。这个已经没太过。<笑> Slow, I always go with like that classic. They put like the chocolate syrup. Oh, the chip. Fantastic. That's a great try. Hello, everyone. I'm the little yellow boy, Aaron. And today I have another of my good friend here. His name is also Aaron. Hello, Aaron. Hello. Actually, his name is Aaron Lyers.、Mm. Yeah. So,、uh, Aaron Lyers is also、um, one of my fellow. Juniors in the same MC Academy that we went to. Yeah, so Aaron is also a professional MC. So if you are looking for two MCs, you can actually check us out. <laughs> <laughs> same name, same confused. Yeah, but you know, just click on my word, do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so Aaron, uh, today, uh, invited you here because I came back from Japan not too long ago. Actually, it's quite some time back, lah. <laughs> Actually, gotten、uh, quite a number of、uh, snacks from Daiso in Japan, which、okay. I didn't see them in Singapore. Okay. So, do you usually eat a lot of snacks? Um, I don't snack a lot, but when I snack, I only choose apparently it's here, Kalbi. Kalbi. Oh, so yeah, a big Kalbi fan. I only like one flavor. Ah, actually, it's the same one that I like.、Uh, Is it the green packaging one? Yeah, <laughs> yes, I see one. Yes. 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 Okay, wait. Are you with lines or without lines? Wait, don't say it first. <laughs> don't say it first. Okay, okay we're gonna count to three, and then、yeah. we're gonna say、okay. okay. lines or no lines.、Okay. One, two, three. No lines. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a big star. Yeah, like the coffee star. Like the king one. Yeah, but actually both are very good. Yeah, both are good. Yeah, so flavor is on point. Yeah, exactly. It's like it's like forever. It's an irreplaceable position. Even with new、yes. snacks coming out, your salted egg or whatever. That one is still like you will still just buy. It. Cannot, yeah, cannot. Nothing can buy it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so yeah, this it has a special place in my heart. <laughs> Cannot go anywhere. Yeah. Okay, so today we have、uh, specially invited you because、um, these are some of the snacks. So I asked the the, the staff there. So what are some of the top snacks they have? And he recommended me this party snacks. So this party snacks they come in small little packaging like this. So、uh, one strip like this is about a hundred yen, which is less than two dollars、okay. in Singapore. So one strip, uh, some like about four packets. Yeah, fifty cents. Quite cheap, right? Yeah, fifty cents. So they say that these are very good for party. So you know, if we host like kids party, yeah, we can actually get some of this, you know, to add the party food. Yeah. Yeah. So today we have four different、um, types. So shall we start? Yes. Yes. Let's start off with four different types. Sure. Generally,、um, for kalbi, I have a very good impression of them.、Mm. You know, in、uh, Japan, there are actually、uh, kalbi. I would say the kalbi、uh, shop. shop. Right. Yeah, yeah. You go、so、to the shop. I think there's one in the、uh, Harajuku、yes. Street, Takeshina Street. And then、um, you go to the shop. You get a chip. And you drizzle all the. Yeah, my favorite is mentaiko. <laughs> Slurp. I always go with like their classic. They put like the chocolate syrup. Oh, the chip. Fantastic. That's a great try. Yeah. So, so they have this easy peel.、Uh, yeah. So it's. I think Japanese are generally very considerate. Yes. So I really like it. The all these small little details. Yeah. So this is tear away pack. Everything is done like here at the factory. I'm just like too careful. Yeah, so I actually very often share with them how I usually open my snacks. Ah, how would you open your snack? Me? Yeah. <coughs> you ask me right here.、Yeah. I usually go for the center because and then, and then I tear it open because I like the. I don't know. It's a pet peeve. I think I would prefer the packaging to be in its almost proper condition. Yes, yes. So if let's say I cannot finish, right, especially the big cubby packet, I can just find a way I roll it, and then I'll get like one of those. Ikea snack stopper. I don't know what、yeah, it's called.、Yeah. You just put it here, and it's nice. Ah, yeah, that's true. Actually, I like to open it this way, but some of them, right, you cannot very hard. Very hard. Yes. Very so, uh, the way I teach them is right. From the center flip, you do right. You tear it down. You tear down the center bit. Until you see a gap. Yeah. Until you see a gap like this. Then you open it sideways. It's the same.、Ah, it's just that. Because the blockage is below the the blockage is above the seal, so with this you can get.、Okay. Mm, so when you、okay. have like those, it's very difficult to just do it like that.、Mm. You 
you can pull down the center and then yeah. This is more for when you don't have scissors. Right. Yeah. I, I mean if you I have mean, scissors. Even if you have scissors I, I don't really <laughs> want to go and take out my scissors and wash it. Could be troublesome, like you know, once you sit at the couch, the <laughs> you don't want to stand up and then you know True. Yeah. Effort is effort. Yeah. So this one it looks like <coughs> it's um it looks like biscuit. Yeah, but the flavor it looks like a barbecue. Barbecue yeah. flavor. Barbecue flavor. Yeah. So can you guys see? I'm gonna smell it and see whether there's any smell. This is a familiar smell. Yeah it is. Inside is like uh, almost about half full I would say. Yeah. Yeah. It smells like see whether uh, it's like the corn snack that we have. Yes. Uh, twisties. No, 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 no. I don't know. Another one. You know the you know the one that we always eat when we were young? This Ferris wheel looking. Oh. It's uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's called a uh, Tulum Ping. Yes, the white one, right? Yes, 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 yes. It smells almost exactly the same. Yeah, actually, it's quite similar. Yeah. <laughs> it smells also a little bit like um, original twisty without other flavorings. Because it's true. Like, you know, twisty when you have curry flavor, then you have a very strong curry flavor. And then at the back end, at the back of it, there's this twisty the smell. smell yes. Or the cheese flavor, you have the cheese smell, and then you have this. This twisty smell. Yes. So this is just the smell of those without the, without the, the flavoring. extra flavoring. Yeah. yeah. Okay, come on, take a try and then we'll see how it goes. Now that you bite it, it's not like a a turbo thing. Mm. Yeah right, it's not like a the smell and the taste doesn't match. Maybe it doesn't match not like my expectation, but it's actually um, not overly salty. Yeah. There are bits of saltiness and there are bits that it's not that salty, it's a bit more mild. The texture itself, um, it's not too soft. No, I mean, first of all, because it's not, it hasn't lost its air. Right? But other than that, you can still, you can still taste like a different crunch. So there are some, there are some snacks that are like this, right? Very airy. Very airy. I know. Yeah, a lot of pockets of air inside the snack. And then, um, then like for example. Some of the snacks here, right? Maybe let's say this, this shape. Like probably a portion of it is like harder, and a portion is softer. Mm. It's a bit of inconsistent. This one is more or less the same throughout. I would say that this is um, a bit more, just a little bit more dense. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's not the air. It's not within the snack itself, mm. but through these small little packets. So you know that some of you just put your mouth, your journey gets softer faster. Yeah. This one will still hold for a few more seconds before it becomes softer. Yeah. And um, I think the thing is because of the shape. When you bite it, right, you just feel that it's the air is not within the snack, but just like in beside the snack. Yeah. I know it's exactly how it is, lah. Yeah. It's exactly how it is. Yeah. It's not bad. It's really not bad. Mm. Flavor wise, it's a very generic salty flavor. Yeah. Like your like just any any kind of MSG uh, <laughs> seasoning that you have. Yeah. So you've been to Japan before? Uh I've been to Japan twice. My first time was a rather short trip about three years ago. Uh no, three uh, three years ago. And um, short trip mainly stayed in Tokyo. Okay. Uh, my second trip was relatively longer. I stayed in Japan for 18 days. Oh! Um, 18 days is quite Yeah. It's still longer by, than my recent <laughs> Because I, I I actually like Japan a lot. Uh, it really comes to its culture. Uh, I mean, my first interest has always been uh, uh, Mask Rider and, and, and Power Rangers. And it, I mean, when I first watched it, it was from, from the American series. And then it. Uh, and then I got to explore a little bit more and I found out that oh actually from Japan yes. and that's how it all started but my, anyway back, back to my trip so um, I went to a few places I, started, I landed in Tokyo mm. and we went down to Osaka Kyoto and then we went all the way up to Hokkaido okay. and we came back to Tokyo uh -huh. that's how 18 days were okay. yeah, so it's a long trip <laughs> I've not been to Hokkaido uh, recently I was there for like a good for 10 days. Mm. So we landed in Tokyo. Yeah. Then uh, we went to uh, Yokohama. Yokohama, okay. Yeah. The, the club music. Then we went to the. Yes, the Nisi 
Cup Museum and then we were there for the Pokemon event ah. and then after that we went to Hakone mm -hmm. after that we went to Mount Fuji area yeah yeah then we went to the Mount Fuji the amusement park yeah, but Fuji Q Fuji Q Island yes then we climbed the Mount Fuji yeah then after that we went to uh, Kyoto Osaka and then we went back to Tokyo for 14 days. 14 days. So you actually is pretty packed. Yeah, but each place about two, day. two days. Two days. Two days. Two, three days, depending. Yeah. Yeah. So we really have uh, uh, quite a spent quite a fair bit of time in Japan. And they say actually in Japan there is 100 beautiful mountains. Mm. You know, if I so if you've not seen all 100 beautiful mountains, you have not finished exploring Japan. So I think we Definitely have a long way to go. <laughs> a long way to go. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so back to the snack. Shall we move on to the next one? Next one. Next one. Okay. I see a lot of vegetables. This reminds me of like a vegetable strip snacks. Uh I have you have you had vegetable strip um snack before? No. I mean the, those that look like this. Usually the shape, whatever is like that, right? I always feel that it's it looks like some vegetable snacks. Yeah. For some reason there are some other brands that right. I eat. Yeah. Whenever the shape is like this, it's mm. always like vegetable flavor. <laughs> Don't particularly have good taste. Do you eat vegetables? Do you eat vegetables often? Are you a vegetable person? <laughs> um, I'm a selective vegetable person. Okay. Selective. So what are the some of the vegetables you I eat or you go eat? I don't know. Wow, okay, uh, I have this, but oh, this is easy to Ah, okay. I, I have a particularly bad smell for coriander. Coriander. Yes. Oh, so you don't like coriander? I I kind of hate it actually. Oh my yeah. god! If I smell coriander, okay. When I was younger, when I my very first impression of coriander was when I was probably seven or eight years old. I was at home and like big neighbors were cooking the coriander, right? And then the smell was just oh so strong. I immediately puked. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it really it was quite bad. But after that, uh, uh, I I think. Maybe because my, my sense of smell isn't so strong anymore Or maybe I got accustomed to it So I don't like it Actually I'm a big fan of coriander <laughs> So that's the difference Aaron that loves coriander and Aaron that hates coriander Yeah actually because I, I grew coriander um, previously mm. So when you start to grow your own vegetable The way for vegetables and plants to grow well right, Is to keep eating them mm. So like if you have keep plucking the leaf they will continue to grow yeah. if you grow coriander you keep cutting off your coriander they will grow very well yeah. and also because I grew coriander so I started taking more coriander so I especially like um, the coriander but there's a difference between um, coriander and parsley mm. so I'm more of a coriander, coriander person, person. Yeah. Okay. the smell is quite similar right? Um, it smells different to me okay. so but I must say that uh, coriander a lot of people uh, it's a love or hate relationship in Taiwan there is actually a dessert where they use the popia skin and then they put ice cream yes. with coriander yes. <laughs> and uh, peanut bits yeah. have you eaten that before? no <laughs> sorry if you no close it up <laughs> actually I kind of like the snack though I was like mm, quite interesting <laughs> like, like what you said like, it's a love or hate thing it's just yeah. like smelling tofu yeah, smelly tofu or the smelly tofu or yeah. like durian. <laughs> like, you like it or you don't like it? Yeah, okay. Okay, back to this. So this one, the uh, vegetable. Yeah, so this one looks like uh, it's a vegetable flavor. So uh, I see there are some vegetables that they put there. Do you take like green pepper or red pepper? What's a lot? Okay, so you're okay with I'm that? I'm okay with them. Yeah. Tomato, uh, what's that? Carrots. Carrot, yes. Uh, this one looks like pumpkin. Like pumpkin. Beetroot. Beetroot. Onion. Onion. Okay, they're not so bad. Yeah. yeah. So long they don't give off like a smell. Mm. Okay, smell this. Mm. Smells generic. <laughs> <laughs> generic. And this is also about maybe slightly less than half full. Yeah. Right? yeah. Correct. Yeah. Uh, the, the difference between this and the earlier one, this is one. Like this is more like a like this rectangular 
French fries. Yeah. Yeah. This is more like a cheap, more like a fries. Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's, let's try. Okay. It's salty. Yes. But the salt level is like a very very thin layer. It's like one second and then gone. Gone. Yeah. So yeah. it's like I wouldn't say it's it's tasteless. It's just that the flavor goes away very quickly. You can see a little bit of like orange chili or red color in the and green color in the the biscuit or the cracker. Yeah, I guess that's the vegetable. Yeah. It's quite nice actually. I can't quite taste any vegetables. Again it's not as airy. Yeah. I thought this type would be a bit more airy. But yeah. So, but apparently it's not. This type of um, snack right reminds me of the Singapore's version of the Jagabi. The French fry style from Calbee series also, but the packet is also like this. It's really like French fries because um, the it is like it is harder. Mm. Like I won't say crispy because you don't really say crispy for like this kind of thing. Mm. But uh, the crunch is similar to how crispy is like. Yeah, there's a crunch to it, yeah. but it, the crunch is like 2 seconds and then it turns soft It does, yeah, then. correct It's not like a plain hard piece Right? Yeah I think that um, the Jagabi, right, has more of a... I love Jagabi food, by the way Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> but I think the, the texture is a little... Not the same for me mm. Yeah, I think Jagabi is like the cr the crunch is a bit harder. It's yeah, like, it's more prominent. It's more prominent. Yeah, but these two are quite similar. Like this one and this one, they're quite similar. The taste, uh, taste, as in the dense the level dense. is there. There are some differences, uh, but uh, very subtle to me. Okay, so they also taste very generic. Yes, they do. Yeah. But I kind of like this more than that. Maybe because of how the snacks are made. Are you like it in strips here? Mm, I I don't have a particular preference, but somehow it catches me on. <laughs> so I guess if you're you want some a bit more healthy for your kids, right? Maybe you can buy this. Yeah, this is a good option. Yeah, and also for kids because mm -hmm. I think you don't want to eat so much at the same time. Yeah. So I think you can say okay, one packet for today, then. You know sometimes when you eat chips right and then like a, like a perceived expectation like wow it's gonna be a lot then when you look at it it kind of looks like there's a lot because maybe it's, a, it's because it's longer okay. but you look at the first one right oh uh, yeah it is like half it looks even lesser lesser because of how the chips because a few pieces but then you know because it's flatter yeah it's flatter it's small you can see yeah, yeah. I agree Verdict, you like this or you like that? They're quite about the same for me, mm. so mm, I'll just take either one. I don't have a very strong preference over one over another. But I feel that this one, the flavor is like one or two more points above this one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I think other than that, mm. more or less the same for me. Mm. How about you? I. I agree with you on the taste. Um, probably one to two points higher for this. A bit more salty. Um, this, on the other hand, I kind like I mentioned, I kind of like the crunch mm. more than that. Probably because of how the snack is formed. Yeah, that's why when you bite right in between, you will have like empty space because of the hole. Yes. Mm. So kind of like this one. Yeah. 好了,今天的影片就到這,如果喜歡的話呢,不要忘記按讚、訂閱跟關注哦,你也可以去看我之前的影片,最後不要忘了轉發跟分享給你親朋好友哦,我們下一次影片再見,我是小皇帝。